What I learned one day when I was being bullied by someone with half a brain, when I interrupted them insulting someone they said had a small brain, well, when I walked into my science class, Biology 12, uh, well, <laughs> I learned what the bihemispherical cerebellum is. And that's, um, sounds fancy, sounds large-brained to say such a word, bihemispherical cerebellum, but in actual fact, you got your brain, it's this lump, it's, it's, and on the top here, there's like two lumps that are little lumps compared to the big lump that's, that's, that's the whole brain. And uh, there are two little lumps and they're kind of round, they're kind of round or something. And uh, there are two of them, they're be beside each other and they are kind of like halves of something bigger. And that means bihemispherical cerebellum. Small brain on this side and this side. That's called language play. I'm a schizophrenic and I'm an artist, I'm a poet, I'm an anti-authoritarian and when the little brain on the left side is overactive, it produces a lot of verbal language. Indeed, on the left side of the brain is where you find the speech center, Wernicke's and Broca's speech regions, which have to do with speech interpretation, the Wernicke, and speech production, the Broca. Lots of speech abnormalities and speech problems that are related to the brain are located in the left side. But language play is also a... Uh, language play is at play for schizophrenics. There's a symptom called word salad, and that's when a schizophrenic is bending words around, going back and forth on meanings, cutting up the spellings, cutting up the reference, and language play often involves delusional thought, it often involves uh, kind of um, somewhat compulsive or preoccupative uh, attention and cognition. It's uh, uh, sometimes the meanings in words will stick out and draw my attention in. And it's also very hard to understand a schizophrenic who's in full-blown word salad. They might be totally incomprehensible and not being able to follow a line of reasoning or a sentence to from start to completion. It's funny. Word salad is a schizophrenic symptom, but when I was doing research on word salad, I looked to Twitter for information on word salad, tweets about word salad, and I found a whole bunch of stuff about other schizophrenics sharing the words that they had thought about, the, the words they saw that they thought something about. But I also found Sarah Palin, the governor of Alaska, who says things which are interpreted by uh, liberals or Democrats or whatever as word salad. Some of the things she has said have been so absurd that people don't know how she could say such a thing. And they tag her quotes with hashtag word salad, which is really funny to me because I don't know everything about Sarah Palin at all, but the quotes are interesting. If you research word salad, you might run into any number of people talking about the speech and words of others as nonsensical, non sequitur, non-compliant, non-destructible. That was a bit of word salad, just playing on the non and words flitting through my head. Well, 
someone asked me about word salad. If you have a question about schizophrenia and, or me or whatever, ask in the comments below and I will look at them later and I will think of making a video.